Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Version 5, 0.55, Lo-Fi is back. We're playing with the Oculus Quest. Um, let's just load, continue where we left off. To fill you in, let me just make sure that everything's running perfectly on the screen there. Right, so we're in patrol mode now. Um, this is the main sort of gameplay loop. Um, right, let's see if I can get the ship craft to move. So, what I'm going to say to you is, if you think about games like Cyberpunk 2077, where you've got lots of NPCs on the streets, they are sort of aimlessly walking around, doing their thing, um, you'll find that in Lo-Fi, you don't get that. It's not that kind of game. It's not about NPCs walking on the street. In Block 303, which is where we're at, people are flying around in these flying crafts. Now in Cyberpunk 2077, you don't see lots of flying craft like this. Um, in fact, the skies are pretty empty apart from maybe Trauma Team and a few other things. So you can shoot down people, um, but we want to scan them and see if they've got any illicit cargo or wanted. Um, yeah, I've got to make sure I don't blow them out of the sky by mistake. So this is the gameplay loop because most people in lo-fi are in these buildings uh, jacked into the mainframe. Um, that's the whole point. So I've got to get close to this ship here and scan. I think it's raise your hand up to your head. Nope. Nope. I don't know what the control is. Um, I'm going to put the HUD on here, like that. Will it auto-scan? Let's have a look. God, this guy's going pretty fast. Let's put the boost on. Yeah, so there's a lot of ships flying around. Right, let's see here. Um, yes, it's auto-scanned. We're in pursuit. You've got a murder warrant. Right, so what do we do? We arrest him for a thousand days. Um, I need to get my hand over there. He's under arrest. Perp is under arrest. He's getting sucked up by the mis And that's what happened. Oh, we're just kind of crashing into it. Right. Oh, upside down. Woohoo! Right, these ships here, these are big craft now. These are new addition. Oh, now it's scanning. Right. So who's that? Amber Farah. What's up? Now you're free to go, girl. I keep hitting my table. You're free to go. Piss off. Um, yeah, so my job is the new sheriff in town. Um, I've got to patrol the skies um, and do some investigations down on the streets. Well, that car looks a bit fancy. Um, let's scan it. No warrant. Good, you can go. You're free to go. Um, unfortunately, because of where I'm seated and I've got this headset plugged in, let me see if I can reset the view. Um, and then I can touch that panel there to let them go. Right, let's scan this big ship here. So the actions might be different. No, no warrant for you, Erin Griffin. Off you go. So yeah, you don't know what you might find when you scan these people. Um, now previously you could earn lots of credits. No warrant. And if you look at his little picture here, He's got a really lot of um, characters, so he added like about a thousand characters in these craft. Um, oh dear. Right, you're pulled over, love. Let me put my siren on. And my lights. Stay put. You're under arrest. I can take a bribe with cryptocurrency or release with a warning. What's he up for? Crypto mining. I'll release you with a warning. Off you go, but don't let me catch you again, bitch. Yes, not that I would remember her name. So look at, if you look in the distance here, look. Look at all the sh ships flying around. There's quite a lot. Loads of them. Um, let's turn the siren off. There's a bit... And the lights. It's a bit not sort of subtle, is it? So yeah, that's the gameplay loop. Sort of um, scanning these craft. Health violation. Um, virus. I can accept a bribe. Oh, I can accept a bribe. Let's take the bribe. Right. Yes, I'll take the bribe. Off you go. So, yeah, so you 
decide how you're going to conduct yourself as a sheriff. Um, you can be a bastard, lock everybody up. Or you could be a more reasonable person and sort of let them go and give them a warning. Um, right, curfew violation. You need to go back in the slammer, boy. So watch what happens now. He's under arrest. The big uh, tractor beam comes down and takes his car away. Too bad, sucker. So, I think there's this point where the game will eventually... I don't think it's in here yet have characters that will actually try and run away and escape um, where you'll have to pursue them and shoot them out of the sky these ones are all pretty passive another curfew violation look at the state of him gosh um, I'll take the bribe bribe accepted now be on your way see I mean you could sit here for hours just being an asshole um, what's this here what is that? Organ running. You're going to the slammer, monkey man. He's under arrest. That's a new craft, that one as well. I haven't seen that one before. Look at that. Wow, he's just sitting there, plotted up. Cool, so where were we gonna go? Um, right, so first things first, to show you the other gameplay loop, we'll head to the Metacorp Tower where we can get some bounty missions uh, when we're on the streets. So let's just land here. So you drive over to these points. Let me turn the HUD off. Kind of a bit distracting. And then when I'm here, I mean, I can't shoot these craft down. He might have been an innocent. Oh dear. I won't ask him any questions, mate. You're supposed to scan them first, governor. Um, I'm the new sheriff in town. And I don't ask any questions, and I don't take any shit from any of you fucking wanksters. Anyway, I gotta land here on this docking platform. It should let me know when I'm hovering over it. And um, yeah, so the ship flying is really nice in VR. Um, yeah, I do sort of play a lot in desktop, but it really is not the same. Um, I can't find the landing platform, mate. Here it is. Oh, back up. And then push the dot button. It's just so more, so much more immersive inside VR, and it's running really smoothly on the Quest Three here. Um, so we dock at Metacorp Tower, high up in the sky. Uh, we got a meeting with one of the governors here. He seems to be like the boss. So let's go inside and get some missions from him. So this is stuff that I've covered in other. Oh, I'm a bit small. Um, I'm like a midget, man. Um, excuse me. Can I sort of stand up? I'll have to stand up. Um, I don't know how to increase my height. So you just have to bear with me as a midget man. Oops. Sorry about that. Sort of. Oh, I don't want snap turn either. Yeah, so you can get sort of information about these bot characters. Um, yeah, this is a bit ridiculous. Uh... I mean, I could stand up and do this. Let me try. Oops, I'm all plugged in. I'm all shook up. Let me take that out. Right. There you go. So I'm standing up in the room now. There was probably an option to turn the snap turning off. Oh, hello. How are you today? Um, response to Donald. Uh, how's the hunt? Oh, I'm still working on it. last known location is on the contract. Come back to me right. when you've got the ghost chip. Okay, you're welcome. Right, so I've got a contract from him previously um, in Tech Town, I think. So let me get back down here, midget man again. Sorry, I prefer sitting down. I'm kind of lazy. Um, yeah, I can't run either. Um, yeah, it's kind of a bit slow. Um, come on, hurry up, mate. I feel like I'm crouching. But there's no button. What's that? Uh, there's no button to um, get me to stand up again. Um, right, let's just get out of here. Okay, like exit to the uh, no, not the cruiser, auto nav. Auto nav, please. Do I have to stand up to do this? Auto nav. So everything's touch sensitive. So the auto nav will now 
let me travel around fast travel around without doing all that cruiser nonsense um, so I want to go to the old no it was um where did I say it was not the club district it was I don't know old tech town there look, it's flashing that's where the um, the perp is hiding but not if I'm gonna be midget man that's not good is it um, this, I don't know how to change the options to I think it's because I pushed the wrong button at the beginning and put it on room scale instead of stationary anyway midget sheriff in town take the person off fucking blow your brains out yeah, I'm gonna have to stand up for immersion's sake so you've got these big robots can you out of the way mate come on move right so your target will have a let me get my... Yes, that's better. Now I can track the target down. Ew. This is really nice in VR. This is just wonderful. Um, ew, pleasure bot. Oh, I've got loads of creds. Hey, baby. How much? I am looking for a date, actually. And I'm all yours. All right, let's go. Oh, I don't have enough. Well, maybe we could... Have a little play around for free, huh? Um, right. So let's have a look around. This is really atmospheric in here. Um, really cyberpunky, very... No, I ain't got time for the arcade, mate. He's fixed up some of the bloody arcade machines. Um, where is he? Or she? Implant tech. Oh, hello. What you selling? Why have you got that vacant look in your face? Can I interact? Oh, I can. I can even take it. Ooh. There he's added a lot more interactable items. Ah, oh, look, my wrist is actually giving me the option, probably, to, um... There's the target, look. That's my target, quickly. Take her down. So what are we going to do? What are we going to do? You do know you're in violation of code directive 157841-2B, don't you? Well, unfortunately, I've been tasked to put you down, darling. Um, sorry. I just want to claim someone who can transfer my ghost ship to a less human body. This thing is stuck me now. It's been used for unspeakable it serves only as a reminder of humanity's humanity. I'm done. Well, that's a nice sub story you got there, girlfriend. But unfortunately, I've got a job to do. And unfortunately, my job is to take that credit chip out, ghost chip, sorry, out of your fucking brain and bring it back to my balls. Um, but unfortunately, on this occasion, I think you got me on a good day. So I'm just going to let you go. Bye bye now. If I see you around here again, I'm going to blow your fucking brains out. Bye. Now piss off. Right. So what do I do now? I have to go back and report back that she got away or some bullshit story. Buy the public toilet. Wow, that's interesting. Why would I want to buy the public toilet? <gasps> Maybe I need to get out of my way. Maybe I need somewhere to piss. Um, and then pissing in public is illegal here, maybe? Yeah, he also added a new video, I think. Um, to these little screens here. So you've got quite a few different little video loop playing, which is kind of cool. I loved all this. This is really fantastic. Um, yeah. This is way improved. It's just so immersive in VR. It's just like, wow. So the fact that there's not really many people around, I mean, you, you, you're overwhelmed with visuals anyway here. Um, sure, it'd be nice to have a few NPCs walking around, but... Um, it doesn't need it, really. It really doesn't need it. Um, I mean, our time here is done. I I'm on to the next contract. Um, I'm going to get back in my cruiser. Um, there's nothing more for me to do here. I don't want to go in the arcade today. Maybe another day. Um, yeah. So, uh, these are your save points. I don't need to do that right now. Well, it wasn't doing the menu. Right, let's see if we can... Um, change the locomotion right move speed turn speed seated that's better 
Um, no. Snap turn off. Oh, that's much better. Move speed, turn speed. Uh, I need height to change my reset my height. Uh, oh, ground step, teleport. Head forward, controller forward. Uh, controller forward, I think is what you want. Um, does this go down anymore? Right. That's good. Um, graphics. V-Sync, no. Oh, Fion Grain, turn that shit off. Ugh. That's it. Um, okay, and controls. Fast travel, reset, seam, item, cheat. Fast travel, no, I don't need that. Right, that's better anyway, but I'm still midget man. And now I've got rid of the snap turn. Fantastic. Right, auto nav. So let's just go to another place here. Um, and just see what's coming down. So that's that's another gameplay loop of doing these sort of uh, bounty missions. It's still flashing that that's um, there. Um, I'd like to check if we see if he's updated New Kowloon. Confirm. But this is all very nice and immersive in VR. It's just really fantastic. And um, I forgot how wonderful this game is in VR. So just to reiterate for people that are not aware of this game, Lo-Fi, it's coming out this year. Iris VR has said he's planning on releasing this this year. Um, progress is slow because there's not many people working on this game. Um, and it's going to come out as a desktop PC game. Also on PSVR 2 and um, PC VR, which is great. But there's no Quest standalone version. Obviously, this game wouldn't run very well. What's this? Oh, shop. I can buy stuff and sell shit. Um, pleasure model. Lots of uh, responses here. So these are a lot of new people added here now in this load. But this is just like crazy overload of um, things to look at here in VRs. What's up, dude? Um, yeah. So another new thing that he's added is being able to get a companion and he's added a cyber dog. Now I don't know where you would go to get that. Hi there girl. Um, got another character here. What are you doing? Just hanging about. Is there something I can assist you with? Carry on. Yeah, so look, he's added more people here now. So it's, it feels a lot more high. How you doing? Oops. Oh, wow. Um, sorry, darling. I didn't mean to do that. Um, so you got... Yeah, look, there's people. There's people. Um, yeah. I feel like... Oh, there's a comic. Comic. Grab, click the comics. Oh, grab it. Grab it. Oh, I don't know how to duck down. Nope. I don't know how to do that. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, you can click the comics. Um... Zex, Zone Express. Uh, that looks like some kind of weird robot. Got to be careful around here. Now I can go around shooting people, rooting, tooting, shooting people as, at will. I'm not sure that's advisable. Yeah, this looks way improved lighting and. Excuse me. What? What's going on with this? What's she got on her? High grade, scrap, take all that. A ghost chip containing a standard metal. Okay, take all. Take, take, everything. Take it all. Right. Um. You won't let me take it. Oh, right. anyway, that's, um. Yeah. Another quest. What's going on in those screens? So yeah, this is all very nice and um, it's running relatively smoothly. Oh, so this is another room here that's not been developed. You can tell because when you put up your HUD, this looks like a door you can go in, but you can't. Not right yet. Uh, another pleasure bot. Nah, I'm not interested, mate. Um, not today. Uh, yeah, so there's a lot more props he's added here. Which is good. This just all looks very nice and um, white mates. That's new. A lot of new sort of um, decals on the walls. Yeah, this is all new stuff here. There's even like oh, another comic. Can I pick it up? Aha! Uh -huh. 
Take item. Take item. I mean, you can read them. I'm not sure I can show you that. That you can turn pages. Wow, I've just lost it. Anyway, yeah, you get the point. Those more monitors he's added here now. So this is a lot more. more. Come on, Irish VR. Open up the fucking sex shop, please. For the resident pervs. Well, hi there. Fancy meeting you here. What are you doing? I'm just on an errand for my guardian. Okay, well, that's a good errand to just stand around on the streets and just look rather provocative. Right, here's a crime scene now. So this is new, having one here. Um, this even looks like a new area. I haven't, no, it's not a new area. Oh, dear, what happened? Uh, what we got here? No time, eh? Found in this rather awkward position by a drone sweep. No witnesses or apparent wounds. Who's the victim? If you're sure. No, 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 no. I'll look around more. So I've got to find the clues about what happened here. I can search the body, I assume. Uh, there might be something that's been left here. I've got to use my scanner, maybe, to see if there's anything here. Whoops, don't want that. Whoa, what happened? Um ask people around um right so this is all very interesting yeah this is not a new area because i remember the free that octopus um i think but i don't remember the three clans um so this is kind of interesting uh, did you see anything what happened back there why is you dead on the floor um no i think this is i don't remember all these um anything i can do for you nope it's kind of cool, yeah. Okay, well, yeah, it's probably not fleshed out yet. But still, nice to be able to... Um, oh, another shop here, noodles. Can I get some noodles, please? Uh, just a few noodles. I'm hungry. I'll have a coffee, just one. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. For, no, not 18. <laughs> We're an OVD. Um, oh, fuck's sake. No, I don't want that many. Oh, Jesus. Um, get out of here. Quit. Quit. Did I just buy all those bloody coffees? I think I just did. Um, well. Nice. This is really nice, this area now. He's, um... Added some new little spaces. And there's even an underground sewer. Uh, that you can go in in one of these places. What the fuck is that? Oh. Um, yeah, really cool. Um... Yeah, so it just looks, it just feels a lot more alive now. Um, yeah, you can go in there, there's a person in there, you can go in and trade, and get upgrades, I think. Um, yeah, it's cool, I like it. Um, let's turn that off, that's it. What am I hearing? Someone talking? Hope you're doing well. Right, so it kind of feels a bit more populated, at least. That's that's one thing. Um, this is cool. Right, so let's get back to the auto nav and go somewhere else. This will be the final location for this particular video. There are other locations that you can visit. Um, right, so we're going to go to... Um, let's go and have a look. I mean, the Wastelands is kind of very different. Um and all of that is different i've shown you in other videos but let's just quickly go to the apartment and see what happens if there's a certain person waiting in there for you um i think you can get that but i'm not gonna spoil that for you for now um i have mentioned it in another video right this is a really nice apartment here um welcome to the luxurious skyworks i'm interested but i can't buy it Right, let's just get out of there. Also comes fully furnished, very nice. Of course, of Put some music on, very nice apartment. And the views are fantastic from here. Wonderful. Um, yeah, place to bring back your dates. Ooh, look at that wonderful view from out the window. This is really nice. Um, yeah. 
Maybe a bit of Nookie in the bed, maybe, with a certain character, or Pleasure Bot that you can bring back, or maybe this robot here into a bit of um, hanky panky. Well, Are you interested in some hanky panky? No. Oh, sorry. What I ask anyway. Um, yeah, nice. Cool. Response to the elevator. Well, let's respond to it. Oh, maybe the elevator's into a bit of hanky panky as well. Hey, elevator, would you fancy a bit of hanky panky in my swanky panky bed? No? Okay. Right, last place. I did say that that was the last place, but it's not. This is the last place. We've been to the club district loads of times before. We don't need to go there again. Um, yeah. Wow. So it's kind of feeling, it's, it's gradually getting there at this game. Gradually, gradually. It's still got a lot of gameplay elements needed to be put in. But I think in terms of the locations now, they're all kind of locked down. If he, if Iris VR um, Anti Cleric can now work in these gameplay elements to have a bit more structure and a bit more meaning behind them, so it's not just a random element, um, then we have a game here. It's finally turning into a game, and um, it's got purpose now. I mean, this is really nice. Um, you just feel like you're here. There's another crime scene here um, to investigate. See, they, these crime scenes are pretty cool. Um, I haven't really sort of shown you what you have to do in those, but um, yeah, this is a really nice area, and I think from here you can get some information. Hi, how you doing? What can I do you for? Yeah, she can give me a tip. So I don't have to know tips right now. I'm after that comic at the back of the room. This one here, weirdo mysteries. Weirdo, weird. All right, you place it in the box, you take it. Ah, I want a random donut. Oh, there it is. Wonderful. I can't pick it up though because I'm too big. Um, <laughs> yes, quite. I think we can pick up some of these items. Yes. Steal that off there. So well, I'm not nicking all your stuff from your stuff, you know what I mean? Um, yeah. So here you can do a spot off fishing as well. I ain't gonna demonstrate that right now. It's a bit of a weird thing to be doing in this kind of game, but um who doesn't like fishing? Yeah, he's put a lot more like that happy robot wasn't there before. Um he's added loads of little bits. So yeah, he's, he's he's been working on this. Um, yeah, it just it does feel a lot more fleshed out, which is good. Um, and yeah, so it does it's, it's starting to feel more like a game, as I've just said. Um, but there's still a long way to go. And if you look at the uh, the the number, 0 0.5, whatever it was. Um, we're halfway through to the development of this game, so there's a lot more to come. Um, but I think those those elements will fall into place once, quite quickly, once he's got sort of the gameplay loop and sorted out of what you're going to do. Right, last place then, just for a bit of contrast, um, just to show you that uh, it's not all sort of cyberpunk city. It's also got some other stuff where you can mess around in as well um, yeah so I'm enjoying this in VR it's uh, really cool and um, I especially feel that play oh gosh what's happening now um what 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 uh, oh I'm stuck in between some buildings right that's it whoa so again I can do the same scanning thing here um, Oh, that's a big ship. That's a big ship. Um, these are new, and I think you can actually scan these. Let's have a look. Scanning, scanning, scanning. You can actually destroy them. We ain't going down about the fight. No, he's indestructible for now. What about this one here that's actually moved? So look, you've got all these ships flying around. Sort of desert wasteland, all these big craft. Scanning target. Stop, stop. No one, Squid. You can you can go. But if I catch you doing anything naughty, of course I'll be on your ass. Literally. 
So I'm scanning these ships. So it's a different contrast um, to what we've just come from, isn't it? This sort of location. Yeah, I can't scan these ships just yet. Um, and these huge craft here, look at this. But this is a really interesting sort of um, area in contrast to where we just come from. And um, ooh, it's a bit spooky here. I mean, you can actually have some radio in these ship if I could just change the station somehow. There's a way to do it. Uh, it's not happening for me right now, but anyway, no. Whoops, oh dear, didn't mean to do that. Sorry, mate. Um, I was fiddling with the radio station. No, nothing's happening yet. Yeah, so there's a lot of stuff in here. Um, so I can imagine that you'll be tasked with hunting certain perps down in this sort of place here and they're a bit more shrouded in this sort of misty, dusty type thing. So yeah, cool. Let's see if we can just arrest anyone else here. I mean, I can't just shoot them out of the sky. But there will be, there will be consequences for that kind of action, laddie. There will be consequences. Um, yeah, so you don't want to just aimlessly do that. But it's your town, it's your city block, 303. You decide, you decide what kind of place you're gonna run here. You decide what law you're gonna um, instill on the people that live here. Um, you're the sheriff. You are the law. No warrants. Off you go then. Um, whether the people will become more aggressive towards you if you decide to just randomly shoot innocent people, um, I don't know. Right, theft. So now this is sort of playing with the heartstrings. Oh, you're poor. If I arrest you, well, look, I'll release you with a warning. I like your sob story, okay? Now piss off. Don't let me catch your ear again. Um, yeah, so that's kind of interesting. So each sort of ship's got its own backstory and its own little quirk. Um, but I mean, I could have just shot her down. You're just a petty thief. Not on my fucking watch. And, um, yeah. Scanning target. I didn't do it. Release you then. Just blow him out the sky anyway, you bastard! Ooh. Oh dear. Well, that was Lance Fisher. Him there. He's deceased. Oops. Um, that's not really going to go down too well, is it, with the populace? Uh, sheriff's a bit gun trigger happy. Um, randomly just killing people. God, these big ships are nice. These are new additions. Scanning target. So, yeah, all right, on your way. Don't worry, don't worry me. I'm just patrolling here. Anyway, look, ladies and gentlemen, this is Lo-Fi. The, the build I'm playing is available on itch.io. You get all the updates. Um... The game's also going to come on Steam. And um, no warrant for him. And yeah, it's really nice to play this in VR. Um, and it is now sort of slowly getting to be a, an actual game rather than a sort of graphics showcase like it has been. Oi, oi, come back here. You're under arrest. I'm going to confiscate your goods. Thank you. Now get out of here. Right. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rob Cram. I'm going to leave it at that. This is Lo-Fi from Iris VR. Um, yeah, support the developer. Wishlist on Steam. Buy it from itch.io. Oh, another rest. I'm taking the bribe. Yeah. Okay. I'm out of here. Thanks for watching.